Stuart, would you talk about the role that gratitude plays? I mean, that, I mean, without it, we're, we're dead people. Without it, uh, there's no love, there's no compassion, the heart is closed. Uh, it comes a life of just, you know, really tension and bitterness and anger and, you know, cynicism. A life that emanates from the head, that's examining with opinions about everything. And I mean, without gratitude, I mean, a human being is like, a, you know, I mean, it's a very sorrowful state of affairs when people live in this world without gratitude. And sorry to say, most people do. That's why the world is the way it is. People with their hearts open don't fight wars. People with their hearts open don't let other people stall. People with their hearts open serve a higher energy in the universe. Gratitude is essential. It's the single most, it's the most immediate way of opening the heart. Without gratitude, the human heart will never open. And there isn't a person alive that doesn't have something to be grateful for. Even the worst, you know, junkies and alcoholics and this, I mean, they're, grat they're grateful for, a, you know, a quart of wine, you know, <laughs> they're grateful for whatever it is that understand i mean everyone has something to be grateful for then it's a matter of whether you use that gratitude to build a spiritual life to attain the thing that really makes a spiritual life happen and that's to be happy in yourself to have joy to have love inside you to live with the highest elements of what it means to be human To fulfill your karma. That's really what gratitude does. Not a difficult thing to understand. It's a very simple thing to understand. It's not an easy thing to do. Because to have gratitude, you have to really develop a chakra that needs to be, needs roots, it needs foundation, it needs a quiet mind, it needs an open throat, it needs energy to move through the sex and undergo transformation. That all of those things work together. It's like a symphony orchestra, the violins and the timpathy, the timpani, or whatever it is. And, you know, the olders and the <laughs> cellos, they all play together. And they have to be attuned to each other in order for the symphony to work. Chakra system is the same thing. And gratitude is one of the great keys because that opens the heart. With a closed heart, you'll never have a spiritual life. You'll spend your life bitching and complaining about everything that's wrong in the world. Instead of recognizing, as I say all the time, life itself is the teacher. Everything that goes on here is teaching us how to have a spiritual life. Even the darkest, craziest nonsense that people do to each other. It teaches us how important it is to get the heart open and how to develop our humanity. The gratitude is 
very important <laughs> part of any kind of inner development. Without it, we're like empty and so on. Thank you. I'm grateful for be sitting in these classes, you know, learning about all this stuff. I'm grateful to be here. And sometimes I wonder, you know, like for this class, I sent out 58 invitations. You know, 20 people show up. And you wonder, you know, what people's needs are and what they do to substitute for, you know, coming and learning how to grow spiritually. It sometimes gets me very tired, I must admit, you know, it's very hard work to do this. And a lot of people really take it for granted. Come, I don't have to come, I don't you know. And uh, it doesn't work if people live that way. But there's nothing I can do about it. You know, I mean, I can only work with those who come and be grateful for the presence of each and every person that's here. I mean that, you know. Because each and every one of you, as I say all the time, is helping me to grow spiritually. And I'm here to grow spiritually. I'm not here to make money, although I know how to make money. I'm not here to, uh, you know, build shrines and to build corporations. And, you know, I'm here to have a spiritual life. And each person that attends this class, you know, makes that possible. And I'm very grateful. Does anyone, I'm also happy to say is the book I'm writing, which I think is, I think maybe might be the most important book I've ever written. And it's almost finished. We're getting close. The editing is coming down to the final wire, to the final ellipsis. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm very, you know, I'm very thrilled. I, I, I know it's going to bring a whole new level in my life, this book. And I'm very grateful for the people who are helping me with it. You know, Jennifer, and Kenny, to get them Bob Sink's input too. I mean, Bob Sink. His input is, he kept telling me this is the best writing I've ever done. I didn't know. I just write. I don't know if it's the best, the worst. It just comes out of me, this stuff. And it kind of inspired me to put a book together, telling me this, this writing is on another dimension. So I have a lot to be grateful for. Well, I'm really tired, very tired. I know when this book rest is it's going to revitalize me does anyone have a question anyone else have a question I hope it's clear what I'm talking about. I don't know how to make it any simpler and bring it down from something that's very esoteric to being something that's absolutely practical in day-to-day -day living. And I think each and every one of us deserves to live that way. To stop beating ourselves up you know, for things we don't even know sometimes why we're doing it. We just have tension that beats us up for no reason whatsoever, you know? Does, does anyone else have a question?
Okay. Uh, there'll be meditation on what is it, Sunday, I think. Yeah. There'll be meditation on Tuesday. <laughs> Well, Monday, tomorrow evening, actually, will be meditation. And looking forward to seeing everybody. God bless you. And again, I thank you. Thank you for your presence. Thank you for working on yourselves. And thank you for demanding of me to work very deep on myself and to try to fulfill what I'm here to do. So God bless you all. Thank you. And there'll be class tomorrow evening. Thank you. Good night. Right. Thank you.